us because <laughs> uh, it's a really big test and it kind of determines the future of your career and whether or not you're going to get to practice. Uh, yes, it does intimidate me as well. It's one of those things where just it's such a long uh, day and it's only 300 questions that really determines uh, if you're going to be able to practice or not. So that's that's really uh, intimidating part. Are you part of the school too? Sure. Yeah! <laughs> Boom! <laughs> so I want to know, does the pants intimidate you? Yes, but I feel like we, when we get there, I think we know enough and I think we're going to be fine. But it's just a... It's a daunting day. You don't really know what to expect and you're nervous, but I think that will be fine. But yes, it's intimidating for sure. Yes. Well, I know I probably shouldn't be intimidated because everyone has such high success rates with it. Uh, but just, it's my whole career on the line with one test. So it's a lot to take in and I know it's long and tiring and I've spent two years just working towards this, so it's a lot for just one test. That's why it makes me really nervous. So oh, I think I think this uh, question is doing more in the pants. Um, I mean, honestly, yes. Eventually, I think it will. Right now, I don't think I'm at the point that I've thought about it enough for it to intimidate me. But uh, yeah, I mean, I'm hoping that we're enough prepared. That they prepare us enough that it's okay. Um, when I think about preparing for it, I'm not as intimidated because I feel like I've taken big tests before in my life too. Um, before school, I applied to medical school and took the big MCAT. I took like the GRE, um, and so I, I'm not afraid of preparing for it. But I know on the day of, I will suddenly get very nervous driving there. <laughs> I mean, it's a yes and no. Like we have been very well trained in our didactic year, and we're even more so trained in our clinical year. But uh, it's like I feel prepared, but I still have so much to learn. So it's just trying to go through those motions, make sure I do those question banks, and you know, look at my prints, prep pearls. Shout out to Dwayne Williams. <laughs> but yeah, no, I think it's something that we can very easily tackle if you just have the right mindset and you put forth the effort. I totally agree with what she has to say. I think if we were to go and take the boards right now, I don't know how well we do. But I think with all of our training that we've had, I know that what we have coming is going to prepare us. We have a great program that we work with. I've been doing question banks all summer long, and I feel like, you know, we're kind of developing into PAs throughout that. Like, I'm building the confidence to be a PA, and that'll hopefully help me pass the test. So I think initially with that question, um, I think any type of board certification exam does intimidate anybody for any type of student, whether you're dental, medical, or PA. But I think I trust my program enough that they prepare me to be able to not feel as intimidated because of the education that we're receiving. So I guess my answer is yes, because it's a certifying exam. However, um, I put trust in my program to prepare me enough to not be as intimidated. Of course I am. The biggest exam, this is what could make or break your career. So yeah, it's very intimidating. It's like everything you've learned over the past two years, you kind of have to get it down. So yeah, it's very intimidating. Of course. Yeah, of course. I mean, it's a, you know, our national certification exam. We bust our butts for two years um, trying to learn everything we can and cram this information in. Um, and it could all fall through if we don't pass this one exam. Um, you get numerous times to take it, but just the idea that it all comes down to this, you know, everything you've learned is placed, you know, all the pressure's placed on this test. So I'd say, yeah, definitely.